Ashford students witness firsthand the sobering realities of being involved in a serious car crash. Carmageddon is part of Kent Fire and Rescue Service's multi-agency road safety campaign when they staged a mock crash at South Kent College, encouraging young drivers to be responsible for their own and others' safety. Firefighter Justin Veens explained where the young drivers go wrong. The main mistakes they're making is driving too fast. 25% um, of 17-year-olds are going to write their cars off within the first year of driving. The biggest killer of um, teenage girls nowadays is teenage boys with their driving. I would just say to them, slow down, you know, and uh, they're driving too fast. They think because they've got a little bit of experience that they're very well experienced and they're not, they can't handle a car in bad weather, in skids, in icy roads and stuff like that. Um, some of them are still, you know, drink driving or taking recreational drugs as well. And, uh, and unfortunately at that sort of age, young people think they're invincible and they're not. The brave volunteer who played the part of the injured driver found out firsthand how terrifying the experience could be. It was quite frightening. You're sat inside the um, car, you've got all the noise going on around you, you can't see what's happening and it's, it's actually quite frightening. One in three young male drivers will write off their car in their first year of driving, with the biggest killer of teenage girls being teenage boys. A fact PC Ian Clark knows only too well. I've been to several accidents, some fatalities involving younger drivers. Today is all about educating them to try and prevent further deaths on our roads. Drive how we was taught, don't try and impress your friends or your girlfriend, and just, just stay safe. Operation Carmageddon continues to tour the county, and with over 500 young people killed or seriously injured in the past three years on Kent's roads, it's hoped the campaign will get the safe driving message across to students. Julie Maddox, reporting for Your Kent TV.